Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. If this is your first time, you're welcome to the family. So what I'm going to do today is I'm actually going to do a review on the Michael Kors Manhattan Contrast Trim Bag in the Optic White. So this bag comes in three different colors, one in the Optic White that I have, and the other one in black and also a soft pink. So all three colors will still have the neon trims around the bag. So this is the bag I'm going to do a review on and just to put a disclaimer out before I start I'm not paid or sponsored to do this video. All opinions are my own opinions and I'm not being paid to, to do this at all. Yeah, so let's get into it. So yeah, so this is the bag that I have and this is in the size medium. I recall there's a smaller size which is a small size and also a bigger one which is a large one. Um, the large one I think is the same, uh, of course this measurement would be a bit bigger, but the small one doesn't have a top handle. So only the medium and the large would have that top handle and the small would be without. And it's, I think it's around maybe a third smaller than this one. So yeah, so let me give you the measurement of this, I have to read off from the screen. So it is by um, 10 inches in width. And then seven, and then around seven and a half inches in height and four inches in depth. So this is actually quite a decent sized bag, and it fits a lot of stuff actually. And the retail price for this is around two uh, four hundred and fifty euros, um, and so maybe approximately five hundred US dollars. Um, yeah, and I and I got this in the outlet actually for a discounted price. So. It was great and so let me show you what kind of compartments or what the inside looks like so when you open it up it has a really big compartment here and a really small one so the small one you can actually fit your phone if you have a smaller size phone or maybe um uh, card holders some tissues um lipsticks and etc and the big compartment can fit actually quite a lot of stuff and inside the big compartment it has in the front pocket it has one pocket here which i have some receipts <laughs> let me take that out yeah so you can slip um some i don't know a mirror in here tissues and stuff and then here it has a zipper compartment where it is quite a decent size as well that you can open up yeah I'm um, store like maybe your keys um your some cash inside it's actually a really nice bag as well oh also maybe I'll talk about the lining as well because I really like the lining the lining is it has Michael Kors written all over it it's a, I'm sure can you see yeah it's like X's crossed over but with Michael Kors written all over it yeah and what I really like about this bag is that it's so colorful. It has like beautiful neon trims around it. So it makes it extra more aesthetic. And I love the oil slick hardware. I, I call it oil slick. I'm not sure what, it, what the proper term is because it reminds me of spilling oil. And yet, so it was. it's on the hooks of here and even on the studs on the strap as well if you can see yeah the, the sides and everything the corners and stuff this bag is really well made i asked the essay what kind of leather this is um i was told it was cowhide leather it feels more like pleather i would say but i of course i believe that in the essay that this is leather i think it's it's lovely it has like orange yellow and pink trim all over it i believe the other colors like the other color of this bag the black or the soft pink they also have the same um color combo like the or neon orange the neon yellow and the neon pink trims yeah so this is what this bag looks like and it, I'm someone who's very small, so I am around 5'2", so that's 158 centimeters, and this fits me perfectly. And another thing that you don't have to worry is that you can actually um, adjust 
your strap and stuff. So here I, I haven't pushed it in yet. I should. I'll probably do that later. But anyway, you can adjust the strap. So I'm on the fourth one. So this fits perfectly um, across my body, just above my hips, which how I like it. And if you're someone taller, then you can make it longer. If, if you're someone who is shorter than myself, then you, there are still a lot of um, holes available. Or you can, well, I'm sure actually you can't. It's actually, there's quite a lot of adjustments there already. There are one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. There are eight available adjustments on the strap. So on both sides, yeah two four six yeah eight on the other side as well so which is quite decent and do um let's talk about the pros and cons of this bag so let's start with the pros the nice things so it's very unique i love it um the leather feels very nice very smooth i love how um there's a lot of neon colors going on but it still doesn't look too much because a lot of times when there's a lot of colors on one item on a bag or a top myself find it very it's too overwhelming but however this just i don't feel that at all i think it's just absolutely perfect and then with the oil slick hardware i think it just makes it so much nicer um i don't see a lot of this kind of hardware on bags that often so it was very nice to be able to see this and actually get my hands on it um i'll tell you a story i actually wanted to get the black version when it came out um i think a few years ago and i wasn't able to i was too slow in getting it i, I was sold out like everywhere and then i kind of gave up on it and stuff because if i try to get the second hand of it it's like way more than what it's what his price is retail priced so but then one day i went to an outlet over in ireland uh, it's called the kildare village outlet and went into it didn't have any plans of buying anything just went there to give it a browse because i haven't been there for a very long time and i saw this sitting there in a the corner all alone and i was like oh my god this is even though it's the white version but i really really like it and i think I got it for um, 60 or 70% off. I can't remember. I can't recall correctly. Um, I got it some time ago. But yeah, very delighted to be able to get my hands on this. Yeah, pros, lovely. A lot of compartments. Um, enough for me, at least. And it fits a lot of stuff and looks great. I think it looks great with casual outfits. And also if you dress it up, it looks great as well. I think the only downside I would say is... Um, this is perf this is a really a personal thing is white i don't uh, this is this is my only white bag currently i did own white bags before and they all got really dirty and i i'm even i tried to wash it and clean it i just couldn't get rid of the the stains or whatever how i got it um yeah i was not able to remember so i kind of told myself i'm not gonna get any white bags anymore or any white things because i'm not someone who's super careful like i try to be careful but not very careful um in the end so but yeah this is something i couldn't pass so so the only thing i will kind of say is the color um because white it's just yeah it's just hard to like keep it like really fresh white all the time and probably in a few years down, like it may or may not turn a bit yellow. I don't know, depending. I'm, I will still take care of it and hopefully it doesn't. And another um, thing that a pro is, it's a bit boxy, okay? So it's a bit thick um, because I'm quite short. So I think this looks a bit, I don't know, a bit like thick and n not as good as I thought it would be however that's only with crossbody if I hold it by the handle I think it looks absolutely fine so I think and then also another pro that I foresee it hasn't happened yet but I foresee is um, when I get scratches on the hardware I'm not sure what the under color is um, I'm sure probably, well, I'm hoping it will be maybe, I don't know, a dark kind of maybe a gunmetal uh, color because then it's not so obvious. But if it's, I don't know, 
bronze or silver like if the card would get scratched the colors get scratched off it becomes silver then i think that will be very noticeable but it hasn't yet because i've only worn it a few times yeah i, I i've been very um because it's like i said it's white um i should wear more uh, more than i have but yeah i'm just super careful because i really really like it and then oh and maybe another pros i keep thinking oh, no, another cons i keep thinking of cons but like i i think i just i think too much but um the strap here it gets bent very easily you know and i get like wrinkles on it you know if you, i don't know can you see yeah there's like wrinkles on here already i think from one bending so um not that it bothers me too much but like in case if anyone's do plan to get their hands on this bag and if if wrinkles it's a thing then you may want to put that into consideration whether you want to get it or not but overall would i recommend this bag absolutely yes i love it so much and i've always wanted it even though it's not the color i want but it this is still absolutely lovely it goes well with my everyday outfit like great for going i don't know grocery shopping or even just go out for a coffee with friends especially this summer it just it just adds so much color onto my clothes because i tend to i know i'm wearing a, like a yellow top at the moment but normally i tend to wear all black or really dark colors because uh, that's what i like and this just brings up lights up my whole outfit and very good quality lovely bag i absolutely love it so Yes, so I do recommend this and I really hope that you enjoy this video and if you do, please give it a like and also subscribe to my channel. Then I'll talk to you soon.